Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. To replace the drain hose in this KitchenAid dishwasher, you will need a 5 16 inch nut driver, a quarter inch nut driver, a Phillips head screwdriver, pliers, needle nose pliers, and potentially an adjustable wrench. Before you begin the procedure, turn off the power to the dishwasher and shut off the water supply valve. If necessary to provide more slack, use the adjustable wrench to unthread the water supply line from the valve. Be prepared for some water to spill. Disconnect the drain hose from the sink drain or garbage disposer and feed it through the cabinet. Use the 5 16 inch nut driver to unthread the two screws, securing the lower access panel and toe panel to the frame. With the screws unthreaded, you can set the panels aside. Pull out the remaining insulation. Using the quarter inch nut driver, unthread the screw securing the junction box cover. Detach the cover. Using the Phillips head screwdriver, unthread the screws to release the black and white power wires from the right side of the terminal block. Unthread the screw to release the grounding wire as well. Now depress the retaining tab and slide the junction box to the left to detach it from the support bar. Use the needle nose pliers to help unthread the strain relief nut. Pull the power line through the junction box. Hook the junction box back on the support bar to keep it out of the way. Next, open the dishwasher door and unthread the two screws securing the dishwasher mounting brackets to the cabinet or countertop. To move the dishwasher, you may need to thread the legs further into the base to lower the appliance. Now gently pull the dishwasher away from the cabinet. Remove the insulation. Use the pliers to release the clamp to detach the old drain hose from the water inlet assembly. And fully remove the old hose.
To install the new drain hose, transfer the clamp from the old hose to the new one. Attach the curved end of the new hose to the water inlet assembly's outlet port and secure it with the clamp. Realign the insulation. Feed the straight end of the new drain hose through the hole in the cabinet. Then gently slide the dishwasher back into the cabinet. Extend the front leveling legs if necessary. Rethread the screws to secure the mounting brackets to the cabinet or countertop. Detach the junction box from the support bar. Feed the power line wires through the rear of the box. Thread the strain relief nut to secure. Realign the junction box on the support bar and slide right to snap it into position on the retaining tab. Realign the black and white power wires on the appropriate terminals on the right side of the terminal block and thread the screws to secure. Secure the grounding wire to the junction box with the screw. Reposition the junction box cover and replace the screw. Realign the insulation. Now realign the tow panel and insulation. Then reposition the access panel and thread the two screws to secure. Attach the drain hose to the sink drain or garbage disposer and secure with the clamp. Confirm the hose is elevated above the connection point to help prevent water from flowing back into the dishwasher. Reattach the water supply line to the water supply valve if necessary. Turn the water supply back on, as well as the power, and the dishwasher should be ready for use.